In this problem, we'll be taking the difference between two polynomials. That means we'll be having starting with one polynomial and subtracting another polynomial from that. The thing we have to remember is to distribute the negative across the entire second polynomial. The most common mistake people would make is to start distributing the negative, but forgetting with at least one term to change that negative sign. So let's take a look at how we would distribute the negative through our second polynomial. For the first polynomial, we can just drop the parentheses because they're not really serving any purpose. But before dropping them in the second parentheses, we need to distribute the negative through. So the negative of negative 5x squared is positive 5x squared. Then subtracting a positive 6x becomes minus 6x. And then finally subtracting a negative 3, the two negatives again make a plus for plus 3. And now we need to remember to combine like terms. So we can combine the 6x squared and the 5x squared together. We can take the minus 7x and the minus 6x to combine those two. And the minus 9 plus 3 to get 11x squared when we add the coefficients. Minus 7 minus 6 will be minus 13x. And then negative 9 and positive 3 will be minus 6.